This is how I hear color. So now you hear differences between red and orange. We do have some very interesting people with us tonight. With that being said, welcome to Mr. Neil Thank you. Neil Harbison is an artist and the world's first government recognized idol. Does that light turn on? It's not a light, it's, it it's picks a camera. Up. It picks up color because I'm colorblind, so I wanted to have a, okay. a new sense of color. Yeah, but that comes off, right? No, no, it's a body part, it's implanted. It really attracted me that he was so different. If someone told me that I could have an operation or something and see color, I would definitely say no because uh, I don't really want to change my perception of color now. Everyone's really curious. Like, what colors are you seeing right now? So I get, ooh, like a sine wave that goes up and down. That two speeches uh, transpose syllable by syllable. The one on the left is Martin Luther King's I Have a Dream. The one on the right is a speech by Hitler. What is your favorite color? Infrared. We're gonna go to Manel's house. He's, he wants to be a cyborg. So I was really interested in the possibility of creating a sensory organ for the sense of time. And in a sense, you want to play God. I feel I'm collaborating with God. There's also internet connection that allows me to perceive the colors from space and also to receive colors from other parts of the world. Sounds fabulous, but why on earth would you want that? We actually promised to each other that if one day it would be possible, we would exchange each other's eye. We are witnessing the renaissance of our species. It's not science fiction, it's already possible. This is happening. 